Commuters in Lagos have displayed grievances over the continuous fuel scarcity which has led to long queues resurfacing at various fuel stations. In this report, Plus TV News correspondent Emmanuel Olubobukun takes a tour to various stations to fuel the pulse of commuters. Queues loom in Lagos and other states, leaving Nigerians worrying about the scarcity of premium motor spirit, popularly called petrol. These skills were first sighted in Abuja weeks ago before spreading to other parts of the country. Recall, during our media briefing on October 10, the group executive director downstream and NNPC, engineer at DME at Ditunji, said that false scarcity would soon come to an end. He had attributed the reason for the shortage to trucks conveying gasoline being held up at Kogi due to the intense flooding. However, an official of the Nigeria Union of Petroleum and Natural Gas Workers, Nupeng, who pleaded anonymity, noted that the reason for the continuous fuel scarcity is as a result of the hike in the foreign exchange and an increase in the commodity from the depots. Consumers of the commodity narrated their ordeals while trying to get the products. Nigeria is one of the um, higher producing country in the world and we are facing one of the terrible problems when it comes to gas, whatever um, petroleum product we, that is for our own domestic use here. It's a problem for us. Something that's supposed to enter under 10 minutes and I'm on queue over, over three hours. So I, I'm, not, I'm not okay at all at all. Very, very sad and not happy about this first case. Since last week, yesterday I came here, I was that NSS bar, I spent five hours before I got this well. I don't know what is happening with this well, which I'm not happy. And today again, I came again. For the, since seven o'clock, I've been in queue. What will it mean that I should leave my home, my family, at 4 a.m. and queue up till now? I've not got fire. What does it mean? To me, it doesn't mean anything. It just, I don't know. It's, it's, it's painful. Some of them blame the laxity on the part of the government as they truly have a big role to play in the rise and scarcity of the fuel products. How come for like so many years, all the leaders, they will come into power, they will do this. We don't have one viable refinery in this country. So whatever they take outside, that's a business for them. What about the domestic use? Government to help us because everything is based on government. Because we people, we have nothing to do except government say something and do something about these skills. We are not happy with the government. Okay. Government are very wicked on the masses and we are coming for them with time. Many independent marketers have been selling between 220 naira and 240 naira per litre, depending on location. However, many major marketers are selling the product at about 175 naira per litre, leaving long queues extending outside their gates. Emmanuel Ulubububu, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.